Russia says they're out. After years of cooperation on the International Space Station, Russia plans to pull out in 2024 amid the ongoing war in Ukraine and international backlash against the Putin regime. A Huntsville space legend who played a key role in the creation of the space station weighs in on what the surprise means for the future of the ISS. Way 31's Matt Kroschel joins us live now from the U.S. Space and Rocket Center in Huntsville. And Matt, the Rocket City continues to play a major role in the International Space Station. Ben Marie, I'm standing inside a mock-up of the ISS here on exhibit, not just for those space kids that are here for camp, but also for anyone visiting this museum. And look, I talked to Homer Hickam, who is a expert when it comes to all things NASA. He looks at this news coming out of Russia and says, while it will add to some challenges for the international community up at the ISS, he says this plan to pull out at the end of 2024 is actually a really bad move for Russia's space program. Huntsville Marshall Space Flight Center played a huge role in getting the International Space Station going. Former NASA engineer Homer Hickam has a pulse on the space program and a history of helping the dream of an international space station become a reality. I was a, a member of the team that went over there in 1994 when we started negotiating with the Russians on how we were going to build and operate the International Space Station. We were a major component of that and continued to be with our uh, payloads uh, operations control center uh, every day. And that work will continue with or without Russia. You know, uh, Matt, I've been encouraging NASA uh, for some time and the other partners to take uh, Russia to task. Hickam says Russia's decision to pull out is a long-term bad move for their space program. He doesn't think they can go it alone. But he isn't sad to see them go after what they've done in Ukraine. The Russians basically have cut off their nose to spite their face. Um, I don't see their space program going anywhere. And maybe by 2024, they'll change their mind. Let's, uh, we'll just have to see. And if history has shown us anything, there may be more changes in space before 2024. In the meantime, the scientific work on the International Space Station will continue. But our research will continue. The International Space Station is a very important scientific platform and also representative of international cooperation. This is not the first time Russia has uh, threatened to leave the ISS, but this time around, a lot of folks over at NASA that are watching this think that it is more of a reality. Now, this really wasn't a surprise to a lot of people either because in the last couple of months up on the ISS, cosmonauts have really not been doing much, neither has Russia, the international community watching this thing very closely, and they say that they will learn more about what the future holds for ISS as they regroup. Reporting live in Huntsville, Matt Kroschel, Way 31 News.